So let's discuss how to dress like me. Now, right now, I'm in my apartment, not the hood, my neighborhood where my father lives. No hoodie, because I'm not smoking outdoors, living in his bedroom, no cigarettes. And I'm not at college, so no hem necklace. Unless I've been busted, I'm in the psych ward. Cut the hemp, leave it on the record stack. So the first thing we need is loafers. No socks, that's for jizz. That way the packy college kid, the psych major white girl, or the weird chain-smoking gay man that's in the underage girls with the black hair like on Fitzy's Cracker Cracker, that kid don't steal your cum and give you a retarded kid. The kid's going to be retarded. He can't prove it's yours. No law forced marriage. So jack off into a sock. Save your socks. Next up, we need the jacket. The jacket should look like you're in the army and it should be green. This is from Seinfeld. Where Elaine hires a guy to work for the catalog. It's a guaranteed spotting job for a professor, either in your college or online, to do whatever you want with it. Just submit material until they kick you out. Finally, we need our uh, hair gel. Now, you're going to want to take this right hand, and I don't care what your dominance is, your manners, and you're going to want to put it on your left hand at the line of the fingers. Now you're asking me, how are we going to get rid of this hair gel in the hands? Well, I got my jacket, don't I? So you just put it in there, it doesn't matter. You're going to want to do this in the morning so uh, it dries out, especially up in New England and or Canada in the winters. And then you just wipe it on the jacket and on your legs. And now you got grip fingers for a knife. For a knife. Finally, if you take your glasses off, you can see how you look. Pretty badass.